The Commonwealth is under a state of emergency because of that blizzard warning, and VDOT crews are warning drivers to stay off the roads. Storm Track Rate reporter Ben Dennis is live in North Chesterfield tonight with a look at the roads and more on the impact these winter storms have had on the transportation budget. Ben. Hey, Eric and Deanna. First and foremost, the proof is in the pudding. John was absolutely correct. No surprise there. That light rain coming down in North Chesterfield right now. Conditions on the road are not concerning. They have been pre treated. But, Eric, as you had just mentioned, I want to point out that VDOT went severely over budget last year responding to winter storms and inclement weather. And this year, the Richmond District alone has already gone through half of their budget this year. Take a look behind me. The early evening rush hour traffic in North Chesterfield already starting to come. Through. Of course, we are keeping an eye on roads across central Virginia. Not long ago, here was the scene in Richmond and Rikos East End, in Goochland, and down in Petersburg. Early evening traffic starting to funnel through. Now is the right time to head home and not head out if you can. That's because conditions will soon get worse once we get below those freezing temperatures. As for sheer cost to prepare, VDOT's Richmond District has a winter storm budget this season of $24.9 million, and 50% of that has already been spent this year, half. In comparison, last winter there was $18 million for snow response, but they spent nearly double that, chilling out $34 million. Eric Dana, I said it at 5 o'clock, but I'll say it again at 6 for the sake of some fun. We wait with bated breath for snow to fall, but right now, nothing at all. Dr. Seuss jokes aside, we are tracking all of the conditions on the road online at WRIC.com and through the 8 News app. But for now, we're live in North Chesterfield. Ben Dennis, 8 News.